Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing mini chocolate chip cookie. This is cookie dough already made, but if you hear any noise, I apologize my kids. I'll be right back and I'll show you what we need. Okay, first we need a pan and we need a spatula, any kind really to get the cookies out. We need cook the vegetable oil cooking spray, which is so much better. Not too much, just one spray is enough. Um, and you need to break these cookies. We are going to put it in the oven for... 350 is the um, heat, so we're gonna turn on the oven, bake, and 355, and we're gonna do start. This light has to turn off, so we'll be right back and get that started. First, we have to spray the pan. I only do it one time, because it's gonna be, as you saw, a little flying, that's because of the oil. Um, next, we're going to take open this up and put it on the pan uh, we'll be right back and i'll show you guys how that is okay so this is how it looks so the thing is my freezer got so frozen so i'm gonna have to let it sit for a while but i wanted to show you guys that it bakes to nine to ten minutes um and you have to pull them apart i bake them a little bit longer but um, high attitude um, bake is 350 and 10 to 11 minutes. So we're gonna wait till this dough is a little soft so we can break it and put it in this pan. And then when this turns off, we'll be putting it in the oven. We'll be right back. Since I cannot break them apart, I'm gonna use a, a knife to do. I think that's better. And I know where it is, so I'm just gonna cut it in there and to the line, and that's how it makes a square. Uh, my fr my freezer is a little bit too much, so I'm gonna keep doing that. We'll, I'll show you how it looks when I'm done. I'll be right back. Okay, so this is how they are. I'm gonna put them in the pan. So. The timer beeped, but the line did not go. So next step is to put the cookie dough in here. I might need another pan, so I'll be right back and I'll show you how that looks. So here are the cookies. I already put them in the line. You have to spread them a little bit further from each other so they don't clump up, because sometimes it does, then it'll be bad. Here's two of the pans I'm gonna put them in. The light did not turn off yet, so when it does, we're going to put it in and we're going to do the timer. Okay, so the light turned off and we are going to go open. Oh, and we're going to take this out. I forgot one more thing. Don't want to forget this part. So we're going to put one cookie. And if you hear my youngest one, I apologize. Um, we're going to put it here. And the next one I'm just going to put on the bottom. So, I'm going to time it to 9 to 10 minutes. We're going to get a timer. Give me a minute. Okay, so we got the timer. We're going to do it till 10, and we're going to start it. So, 9 minutes for it to bake, and we'll check in a little bit. Okay, so we have 3 more minutes. We're going to go check in a little bit. Okay, so this is how it looks like. It's not ready yet. If you see they're like clumps still, you can still leave them just a little bit, a couple more, like another minute or so. Okay, so we're almost done. And so we're going to turn it off and check on it. So they are like this. Um, I feel like maybe they could grow a little bit more or maybe not. I don't think I will do any more because I don't want them to burn. So see the bottom and the top, I'm going to take it out. I'm going to turn it off and let them sit a little bit. Maybe they'll grow a little bit more. Okay, so here are the cookies. They are done. I'm going to let them cool off for 10 or more minutes and we can take them off the rag and put them in a plate. Um, they look so good right now. These are mini 
uh, mini Toll House, Nestle Toll House mini chocolate chip cookies. Um, I'll put in like the ingredients and all the stuff. These are frozen, store bought. All you have to do is pop in the oven and it's made. Um, and we'll be right back till it cools so I can show you how they look in a bowl. Okay, so this is how they look like. I put them in a regular pizza tray because it would cool off quicker. And it hasn't been 20 minutes, it's like 10 minutes, and they already cooled off. So this is how they look like. Yes, they look funny because I cut them and they were a little bit too frozen in my freezer so they're cooled off and they're ready to be served um i am going to let my daughter try and see what she thinks of it okay martha try what do you think of the cookie is it good yummy oh she seems to like you like it mm -hmm. so my daughter loves them and my boys so these are really good to grab in the store and they're really easy you just break them put in the oven let them cool and eat them and they're so yummy any grocery store called um toll house mini chocolate chip cookie cookies and they're really good with milk juice tea um coffee whatever you like mm, it is so good look at that cookie looks so good well, that is all I have for you guys today. Don't forget to like, comment, share, turn on your notification. If you have not subscribed, please do. You guys have a wonderful um, Wednesday, and I'll see you guys next video. Bye, guys.